Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, guys, wherever you are. It's beautiful. Whenever you're watching this YouTube video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel. Today, I have this amazing video. No TA, no charts, no nothing like that. A beautiful Web3 Bitcoin, Ethereum, NFT, blockchain, whatever you want to call it, hotel in the middle of Agarf that is found by some beautiful crypto people and that want to convert it now into that beautiful spot that everyone is already searching for for the last three years, including me. You know, that all the videos I made with the land and now I found this thing that I want to share with you guys. We don't have any deals yet, there is nothing signed yet, but that is like a very promising place that I want to show you around, take you with me inside and then show you what it can become. It's going to be really beautiful. Uh, I know for sure that that's something I can share with you guys already. You can see already the entrance here. Um, you will get an overview of the whole building, of course, as well. Uh, you will have this drone image and all that stuff. Maybe my image sometimes is a little bit dark, but let's see. I'm going to go start directly at the bottom. And this hotel was built a couple of years ago. It never opened because they had some issues. Now some smart uh, Ethereum people uh, bought the hotel and they want to create a beautiful Web3 hotel out of it with all the Web3 experience and NFT artists and all that stuff, guys. It sounds hollow because it's completely empty. Um, it has never been used. So the quality is still good, but it needs a clean up, a fix up, and the rooms need to be, uh, you know, divided and all that stuff. But I will show you. Uh, then at the end, when everything is done, you will have a Web3 Bitcoin based hotel here, beautiful in the Algarve, that can become the crypto hub for all you crypto addicts out there. Yes, with the own inside and outdoor pool. This is going to be, of course, the wellness center out here. Okay? The pool, you don't want to be in it now. But it's going to be a wellness center, guys. And it's beautiful, big. There's even, I'm going to show you here, they still have the steam beds and all that stuff up and running. Sorry for the light, there is no electricity yet. But if you look over here, look. They even have the steam beds. Everything was built. Look, this is going to be the favorite for a lot of, uh, of you Wim Hof addicts over there because we will be able to dip in this pool. This is an ice bath. This is the ice bath challenge. But this is a web-based ice bar challenge. Look, you're gonna freeze your balls off when you get here. But that's what you need to do after you visit this beautiful sauna. Of course, over here there is a sauna, guys. Yes, you can see my ah. Now my extension rod is starting to work. Finally, now I can flip the screen. Look, the battery. This is this beautiful sauna, and bam, ice cold over there. So whoa, back to my face. Yes, this is the like the the lowest floor. Um, there is also some beautiful rooms over here with showers. Um, this could be a beautiful fitness, you know, for all the people that like to fitness and do some sports, like me, <clears throat> like that. And um, we have, of course, outside the garden with a beautiful tree. Yo, we need to trim the tree. But that's the most coolest part, I think, of the whole project. It's going to be probably a little bit more community-based project, which means yeah, people will be allowed to become part of it in a cool way, maybe NFTs, maybe, yeah, we don't know yet. Um, I just met them uh, the second time now and I really are enthusiastic about what we could make out of it, but we don't have like the concrete plans yet. But because of that, we are doing some evenings, but we'll talk about, about that a little bit more and you can visit the place already, you know, and get an introduction and all of that to the team. Um, I think we need to clean the jacuzzi. But yeah, I hope you guys are going to sit in this jacuzzi with me very soon when we are able to open this. And to open it, of course, there needs to be some funding. But again, we are all structuring that and I will talk about that later. Let's see, uh, here this is the downstairs hall with all the kitchens, not so interesting. But there will be restaurants, of course. If we go through a lot, it's getting dark. Yeah, this is the dark part of the moon. And in the dark part of the moon, we go up one floor just to show you what is here. Uh, in this beautiful space, we have, of course, look, um, all some more, I think, wet areas. I think it's like toilets and everything for the employees that should be here. And we could, we could even say part of the garden. But I will show you the garden <laughs> a little bit more uh, when I'm on the rooftop. But if I continue my walk, 
I will come somewhere into the restaurant area. I'm not going to show you all the kitchen and all the stuff, guys, because it's all needs built yet. But uh, the restaurant area is a beautiful area. Look, we even already um, have the buffet area. <laughs> it's all built, never used, needs to be completely cleaned up. It's going to be a beautiful place. Conference doors, everything. Look, they even have a beautiful fireplace. And this could be the restaurant area that leads into the pool area. You can see the pool on the back already, but you will see the pool later again when I come uh, from the rooftop. And so we have this fireplace over here. That one over there. Look, this could be a conference room, restaurant, whatever else. You can make a lot of things out of this. And it's going to be part of that beautiful Bitcoin blockchain hotel, guys. Let's take you up to the floors where the rooms are. So in total, there will be probably something like 10, 12 normal rooms, and then five VIP rooms. This place is massive, look. Wow, this area could be this beautiful, like, web 3, 3D area where you can do it all somewhere. You can experience 3D, like with the glasses and all stuff, you know. On the back over there, you can already see other hotel. That hotel, you can see over there, guys, that is the W. Beautiful on the Agarf, W Agarf, and it's your neighborhood. That's class. We need that class. There's a lot of rooms and a lot of cleaning needs to be done. We're going to take you a level higher, guys. Oh, wait, can I go that way? Let me see. Here. I'm getting lost. I'm lost. It's so big. I'm just going to walk this way, guys, to show you around a little bit more. There's a lot of space and a lot of things still to be done, but uh, you know, when you're a big community that wants to own a beautiful blockchain hotel, yeah, you should be here together and work together and create cool stuff together. So this is the level with some rooms. You can see I'm passing by all the rooms. Um, all of these rooms are finished, but not completely. Like for example, this room, I'm just gonna walk in over here. Look, the room is finished. But still needs to be the closet and everything built in. On the other hand, the wet room is finished from there. But I think these walls need to go out. It needs to be a transparent window. But there is a lot of things that can still happen. I don't know if the doors are doors closed. And with these rooms, these are the smaller rooms. But yeah, that's uh, where you need to have input from all the people, of course, that would love to become part of this beautiful thing. This is really an awesome place, guys. It's like, I didn't count the rooms. Did you count the rooms? I didn't count the rooms at all. <laughs> Let's start from the beginning. <laughs> Let's start on this floor. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven rooms on this floor, guys. So there's eleven beautiful rooms. With all a garden view, but you will see the view later. Of course, there is an elevator in the building. Um, the hotel was built in a class four star hotel. The neighbor is five stars, so we should upgrade to five stars. But that's all depending on the community, and of course, the funding and all the stuff, because we are going to raise capital. And I'm just here to share with you guys again an opportunity that we can become the first community that builds this. Beautiful place in Hong Kong, a Bitcoin blockchain, Web3 hotel, however you want to call it, it doesn't really matter to me. It just needs to be a crypto hub for all the crypto people that want to, somebody in the elevator, that want to become part of something beautiful that we build uh, as a community and leave as a legacy and also leave here, built here to show the whole Hong Kong and the whole world that the blockchain industry is a huge industry that can collectively build amazing stuff. Look, yes, these rooms, of course, have sea view. Yes, sneak peek. The rooms are dirty, but look how close we are to the sea. And how green it is over here. But you will see more. So this top floor, they think, or they want to rebuild uh, into five huge ambassador suites, or two presidential suites, and five ambassador suites. So there's a lot of possibilities to do with all these rooms. But I will show you uh, from the top how it looks outside. And again, it's 11 rooms here, but then, okay, they want to divide it and make bigger rooms on the top. So for the people that want to get into the project a little bit more early, and they have the possibilities then to get access to the 
higher end rooms and all that stuff, uh, which could be really cool, of course. Um, there in the middle, you can see the small bridge. With that bridge, you go again with the elevator to the downstairs floors, of course, to the spa area. Let me go up here. This is going to the rooftop. It's not finished yet, the rooftop. But up there is the key. Over here. On the rooftop, you can get a better, a better picture on how beautiful the place is. Look, this part of the rooftop could be beautiful to make a terrace and a small restaurant and a small bar and all that stuff, which is nice. Again, there you have the W, so we are really close to the W. And if we go up completely, now I need to have some exciting music, like, doo -doo 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 -doo, like something like that. And I'm gonna show you this part that still needs to be built, of course, that gives you an amazing 3D view of the Algarve. Beautiful sea over there, guys. And the whole roof, look, this whole part over there should become a big rooftop terrace. And the whole rooftop terrace will have this amazing view over there, guys. Check that view. That is an amazing view. Completely surrounded by the sea. How beautiful is that? For all the people that want to know where we are, next to the W, beautiful hotel. So just imagine that you can go from here to that part and there will be decks with chairs that give you this amazing view. And then on the bottom, of course, we have the garden over there. I need to go to another room to show you that better and then show you the garden. It's the garden with the pool and the kids' pool, but the pool will be extended and all that stuff. So the pool and all that stuff, they want to make bigger. Of course, there will be a garden with an outdoor cinema, with a beach vibe, so there's also a beach at the place. So it's gonna be a beautiful crypto hub, guys. A beautiful crypto hub. What do you think about this, guys? Could this be the next blockchain hotel in the Algarve, or the first blockchain hotel in Algarve, I need to say it like that, that has beautiful um, a Web3 environment for all people, like beautifully set up and all that stuff? It's not the like yeah, maybe you can see it from here. So uh, the door is really dirty over here, guys. But next time it will be clean. So downstairs there, you can see that whole land and the white wall. So the end of that white wall and the end of the stone brick wall, that all can be built with this beautiful large beach area where you can sit together, hang out, you know, and create an outdoor experience with a bar and with an outdoor cinema. So a few of the rooms will have, view, uh, have a cinema view even from here. So that could be a really cool thing. There's, there's a lot of possibilities and opportunities for this place. And uh, yeah, I, I really want to get involved. I, I'm, I'm talking to the team now two times. I, this time I decided to make a video about this because I want to know your opinion. I want to know what you think about a place like this. Would you want to be uh, owning, for example, one of these beautiful VIP suites? and pay a little bit as an investing that could be part of the funding or would you want to own NFTs that give you access as a to the a VIP member club so that you can use the fitness, use the spa, uh, stay in the room for a couple of days per year, uh, also get DAO decisions to make and everything. So there's a lot of possibilities with this place and we're still figuring out which direction to go but we also want to interact with the community so please you should be letting us know um, the possibilities that you want to see when something like this would be built. I just want to be here with a beautiful beer and uh, enjoy that beautiful view. Amazing view. And then those people over there from the W, they will come here and visit us because they will want to spend some sets and other cryptos and experience a day in the crypto life. So that's all possible clients in the future, guys. All possible clients in the future. Beautiful place. Now, let me know down below what you think about this place. Do you think this is a go? Should we start something here, like a Bitcoin hotel? Or should we just open a normal hotel? I want to know for my followers. <laughs> yeah, I'm tired. <laughs> what you think about this place and would you like to get involved? Then send me already a direct message. Uh, if you have my contacts, uh, we will also open a Telegram group. And the Telegram group, will, the link will down, be down below the video. And you click that link, you go into Telegram. Uh, you won't be hacked like I was hacked, but you will get access to a Telegram group. And there you can ask all kinds of questions and maybe even discuss about the possibilities that we can create over here. So I think it's a really beautiful spot. Uh, the location is really beautiful. 
It's like a 30 minute drive to Albufeira, it's a 30 minute drive to Lagos, uh, Portimao. It's completely in the middle of all of that stuff, so which is, uh, which is I think, beautiful. I think Albufeira is 15 minutes. I think Villa Moura is like 30 minutes. So it's, uh, it's a very nice location near the beach. I think it's a 10 to 15 minute walk on the path through the forest into the beach. Uh, you can also walk on the streets to another beach over there. So there's a lot of small bays over here that give you a beautiful Portuguese uh, feeling that you should have. For to rebuild, of course, funding is needed. And we are still figuring out with the team, or the team is figuring out how to do the funding rounds with an NFT or whatever. And I'm, I'm still figuring out if I want to be, become part of it. My heart says directly, yes, Didi, you need to become part of it. You need to become part of the first place out there in the Agave that is going to be completely web3 based bitcoin blockchain hotel and going to drive the adoption of crypto massively in the Algarve. i want to be one of the par founders of this project of course uh, but let's see you know we always uh, need to come out and um, in a positive way for everyone a win-win-win situation so that is why i'm just showing you around now and letting you know that's possible to become and visit here. We are going to organize a few barbecue evenings, I think in July, also for the local people here in Portimao and, 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 and the whole area. So there will be some barbecue uh, um, nights where we can talk about Bitcoin, blockchain, live hotels and all that other stuff, guys. So yeah, that's a beautiful day, I think, and together with all same-minded people that just can not brainstorm about what the possibilities are for a place like this. It's already bought and owned by those Ethereum people I talked about in the beginning of the video. So it's owned by the company. So it's not like something that we still need to buy. It's already bought. It's already there. And from now, it needs to be going to be built into this Web3 beautiful uh, location. And for that, of course, funding is needed. But that funding should be done by the community so that the community becomes part of this place and they get access to all the stuff that they that is here. So that's a very important part because it needs to be a community-driven crypto hub where everybody has a saying in how, what events should take place and all that stuff so uh, there will be a white paper there will be all that stuff guys but I will this is just the first video I'm making about it and many more to come I'm going to go two weeks now to the Netherlands and after those two weeks uh, I will be back here and start to interact with the team a little bit more make more videos maybe include the documentary maker into it as well and then from that moment on we will see uh, what we can create out of this beautiful place that is already here and paid for and i want to thank you from the rooftop of this place uh, very much for watching this video if you did like the video give the video a thumbs up share with your friends and subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell leave a comment the birds are attacking the drone <laughs> look i think he's afraid that um, the drone will take his nest or something but yeah at least he gave me a good shot for my video hopefully the drone won't crash hopefully he won't crash and then I'm going to leave you with the message that we should be collectively build a better future for our children and this place could become part of it. This place could be the accelerator. This could be the first place ever that is going to be built by the crypto community in a beautiful um, area in the Algarve where crypto adoption is growing every day as we know with the Bam Bam Beach last year. Thank you for watching. See you tomorrow again. Bam!